on Tech It Out, we keep bringing you updates from the world of robotics. Up next, we tell you about robots in space. Humanoid robots going to space could become more common as technology advances. Here is more. The world of robotics has witnessed major developments over the years. Robots can now walk, talk, cook, paint. Well, they can do almost everything that a human can. Humanoid robots are becoming more lifelike. Engineers believe that with the right software, humanoid robots can function similarly to humans. Space experts believe humanoid robots are ready to play a greater role on Earth and beyond in the coming years. Look at this. This is Valkyrie, a part of NASA's humanoid robot fleet. Valkyrie is 6 feet 2 inches tall and weighs 136 kilograms. The humanoid robot has been named after a female figure in Norse mythology. Valkyrie has been designed to operate in remote areas or places that have been hit by natural disasters. But robots like her could also one day operate in space. So we're not trying to replace human crews, we're, we're really just trying to take the uh, dull, dirty and dangerous work off their plates to allow them to focus on those, those higher level activities. Another robot by NASA, Robonaut 2, was built and launched in 2011. Robonaut 2 was the first humanoid robot to enter space. It returned to Earth in 2018. Back then, Robonaut 2 performed basic tasks in the space station, like operating a control interface and measuring airflow from a vent. In recent years, NASA has partnered with robotics companies like Aptronix to learn how humanoid robots developed for terrestrial purposes could benefit future humanoid robots destined for space. Aptronix is currently developing Apollo, a humanoid robot designed to work in warehouses and manufacturing plants. In many ways, the systems of today um, including robots like Apollo, are designed with modularity in mind to be able to adapt to many op applications. And uh, you know, that's where NASA is really trying to get that insight to see um, what are the key gaps where we would need to invest in the future to bring a terrestrial system um, into the space environment and certified uh, for operating in space. Experts believe that humanoid robots in space could potentially handle risky tasks like cleaning solar panels or inspecting malfunctioning equipment outside the spacecraft, so astronauts can prioritize exploration and discovery.